Hi, this is Mr. Kresselt once again. And in this video, I just wanted to take a moment to, um, you know, show you guys a few, uh, I guess, kind of um, lesser known tools. And, you know, it's kind of random things to show you how to do a few, I guess, pretty advanced um, steps. Uh, what I'm doing here is I'm creating um, just basically a, a rectangular shape with a um, s cylindrical object kind of protruding from it. And what we're going to do here is I'm going to make a um, transition from this circle to um, this square back here. And we can do that really easily with the loft tool. So I can click on the loft. And actually, before I do that, let's take a look at the preview. And what it does is it creates a transitional shape between two or more sketches. And right now, I've created my two sketches. I got my circle and I got my square. And what it will do is it will actually go ahead and just create that transition for you. Um, this is used um, quite a bit with plastics as well as um, you know, with fiberglass materials. Um, and there you have it. It creates that transitional piece for you, which would otherwise be very complicated to make. The next thing we're, I'm going to do to this is I'm just going to hollow it out. I'm going to give it kind of a shell shape. And to do it, we click on the shell button, which is right up here. And it, this actually removes material from, I guess, the inside of a part. Um, this is used a lot with containers. This is used a lot with um, anything that, um, anytime you want to have just a hollow inside. So sometimes, like if we were going to have a computer actually make this, um, sometimes to save materials, we would have the inside be hollow instead of filling it up unnecessarily. We just add in our thickness. Um, right now I have my thickness at one-tenth of an inch, which I guess for this is pretty good. And just click OK. And that actually just went ahead and it created a, a hollowed out object for us here, which is kind of hard to see on the inside. But you can tell that it is hollow in there. I want to go ahead and change the material to some kind of a clear uh, plastic. And there you can kind of see it a little bit better. Um, so, so this is great for, um, like I said, uh, things like containers.